Well, the road to the Olympics is a journey that takes athletes years and years, from local competitions to world championships. It's a long road to get to the top, but one local 13-year-old trampolinist is on his way. Ruta Osanida has more on the kid looking to represent Omaha in the Olympics one day. Tight. Trampolining. It's a sport that requires agility, strength, and determination. Yeah, it's tough. Better. 13-year-old Gavin Britton from Bennington, Nebraska. Kids like this don't come along very often. Just happens to be one of the best. I've been doing it for five years since I was eight. He started little. He liked to flip around the house, so I needed somewhere for that energy to go. He competes all across the nation. I like the traveling part about it. It's just really cool going all over the United States. And it is really cool going all over the United States. But what's cooler to him is going to Tokyo this December for the world championships that he qualified for. It's a shock. Like. My kid's going to be representing our country in Tokyo in the same venue as the Olympics. Just happens to be in Tokyo prior to the Olympics, so he's actually going to be competing at the same Olympic venue that the gymnastics will be competing in next year. Getting to this level for Gavin required lots and lots of practice and a lot of family support. It is a lot of time away from school and a lot of time away from work, but it's worth it in the end. The World Championships give Gavin a chance to stand out on an international level. It's competitions like these that could lead to something bigger for him in the future. In five more years for the 2024 Olympics to be able to go through the trials, hopefully, and, and uh, have a shot at, at the 2024 Olympics. Watching your kids hit their dreams and goals at 13 is pretty cool. Perhaps the next Summer Olympics in Paris will be his next stop. Reporting in Omaha, Rudolf Sinaida, 3 News Now. That is pretty cool. USA Gymnastics doesn't cover costs for athletes to attend the World Championships in Tokyo. To help Gavin get to Tokyo, you can donate to his family's GoFundMe page, which you can find on our website, 3newsnow.com.